I'm seeing, it actually generates a state of contentment. So, it's like Buddhist enlightenment at the touch of a button. <laughs> yeah, that's a good way of putting it. Seriously? Alien mind control? <laughs> I'm not so sure about that. Well, the only way to know for sure is to try it. And how would aliens possibly know about human physiology? I'm more concerned about side effects. What if it turns everyone into a jackass? I'd hope not. One of you is more than enough. Oh, I am the jackass now, huh? I'm not the one who sends pictures of my butt to the entire colony ship. Back off, boys. Jack, can you give us an estimate on the research effort? I'd say 48 hours until we can fully reverse engineer the activation system. Roger that. Keep us posted. Congratulations on your referendum victory, boss. Seriously? So all of that, and there was no supernova after all. Oh, hey, guess what, everybody? It was all a big joke. Sorry about those millions of people who died in your civil war. What a crock of shit. Yeah. So it turns out, that's like an interstellar initiation ritual for advanced civilization. It's like a test. See, once a civilization gets advanced enough that it might finally be worthy of joining the club, so to speak, they tell them they're all gonna die and they have to fit their final words into a paperback novel. And that process is really ugly and starts a lot of wars. But it forces them to figure out who they are as a society. It makes them come together and figure out what's important and what's not. Sort of the way before we got on the Avon Prime expedition. We had to get all our luggage under 38 kilograms. And a lot of species don't make it. Unbelievable. They must have been pissed. They were probably happy. I mean, they just found out they actually weren't going to die a horrible death. And you're not going to argue with some big alien mothership floating overhead anyway. Hmm, good point. So, what happened after that? Or do we have to wait another chapter to find out? Sounds like they left the planet. Once the mothership showed up, they learned how to make ships of their own. And they didn't have that crazy death cult around to hold them back anymore. So that explains that Serdari guy, and what it meant when they said they left him here until he could join them again. So that means... He might still be here. Bingo! Maybe, maybe not. I'm hoping we'll figure that out with Chapter 5. Oh, great. So we might be sharing the planet with a crazy mass-murdering alien shapeshifter from an evil death cult. That just makes my day. 
Makes you think, doesn't it? Uh, there's one more thing. There's another artifact in an area known as Eden Crater. I'm not sure what it is, but it's clear that this is a more valuable object. Does it have something to do with that Sedadari character? I don't think so. Okay. We'll have the High Commander start a new colony in that location so we can recover the object. Eden Crater. Sounds peaceful. No, it isn't. It's actually in one of the harshest locations on the surface. Get ready, High Commander. This is gonna be your toughest mission yet. <laughs>